Hello guys, I'm gonna show you how to make a DJ booth. Yippee! That's awesome. So uh, DJ booths, yeah. Um, put it quite simply, when it comes to making a DJ booth, first off, there's a great deal of diversity. So you can make it in so many ways. But the key components of a DJ booth is one color and two anything that looks like music, such as speakers, turntables, discs, etc., etc., etc. So we're gonna use this area as our DJ booth. And we're going to go ahead and just get some colorful things going on. And see, the thing about colors is each color scheme tends to have a different effect on the emotional state, the psychological effect. Like blue means trust, and oh, what does red mean? You know, it's funny, I used to have these memorized, now I'm realizing I don't. Um, but red seems, red seems to be more like energetic excitement. Same with yellow. So red especially is a good color. Green can be good too, but I tend to li not like green to go with red because I think that um, it makes it look too Christmassy. If I use green, I like to put it with blue. And since blue is a color of trust, do a light blue and that's a little bit more energetic. So why don't we go ahead and do the blue-green scheme. And we're just making sure that there's color here where this DJ booth is going to go. Now here's the center and we're expecting that our turntable is going to be here. So we're going to put our jukebox, if I can type, <laughs> so, uh, silly me, okay, jukebox, mm -hmm -hmm. yeah let's put it right there. Now we're going to want an item frame here and then let's do a note block for, you don't have to use note blocks, but I'm going to anyways. Let's do some item frames here. Now we're going to put discs in these two, and these are just for looks. And you know I've decided to remove this item frame in the middle because I think this will look better. See, I think that looks more like controls and those are two turntables. Now let's put some slabs down. I'm using acacia because they're colorful. And let's put a trap door right here. This is kind of how you get in and out of the booth area. Now we're going to want some speakers. So you can do fences or walls. Um, I prefer walls because of the diversity in colors. Again, you can either choose something that stands out or something that matches what the speakers will be. In this case, I'm going to use black wool for the speaker, so we're going to do something dark. We're going to choose another rack. If you're in survival and you want to do something cheaper, I would choose dark oak wood planks. Okay, so we're going to put those up there like this. And the speakers will go on the top there. Except well, let's do it one up forward actually. Because we don't want it to get in the way of the door inside. Okay, now we want the wool. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Now we also want the item frames. And in the center, you just put more black wool. And that gives us some speakers right there. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Now we're not done yet. Let's put a button down on these two. Let's even put a sign here. Um, I always use birch signs if I can, because they're easier to read. I also think they look better. DJ Awesomeness. Yeah. And you could technically end right here, but we're not going to. We're going to put a barrel. Let's see. Let's actually let's put the barrel right here instead. I think it looks good. And then this would be like where your discs go. Put your discs in there and keep them there. Now we're going to put a stair right there, and that's going to be our chair where if we're just sitting here and nothing's going on. Oh, hello puppies. Uh, yeah, I've got a lot of dogs. Okay. You sit right here and wait, and when a dance comes in. People here are having fun, and you can have your dance. This is looking pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, but we're not done. We could be done, but why not keep going? Let's choose some exciting colors. This is where we like to use stained glass. I'm going to remove the glowstone because I'm also actually going to put something else there. Well, actually, I'll just tell you what I'm going to do. It's going to be redstone lamps. Let's see. Uh... Yeah. And then I'm going to break right here just so I know to come up here. Because I'm going to do something cool right there. Alright. 
Uh, let's put this awesome glass right here. Yeah, let's put on each side. And you can put this glass stuff wherever you want. You can actually just put it like right here if you wanted to. See how it kind of spruces it up? Not too bad. And, you know what? Since this is like a dance floor, or it's going to be a dance floor, you can even go like this. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, it won't give me the item for now. I'll try again. Okay. I got that stuff going. Now I'm going to do the last thing. Granted, you can keep going, but this is the last thing I'm going to oh, do for my DJ booth. We're going to come up here. And I said before, I need to make sure I can get up here. I'm actually going to remove... Oh, I didn't mean to remove that. Well, who cares? This is about showing you how this works. Okay. Now we need some redstone circuitry. Oh. Peter and redstone. Let me verify. This red doesn't okay. Let's see. Just a second. I need to see if red's I forget. It's redstone power below like that. Yes, that's good. You want it to be that way. Okay. Let's just use cobblestone. Okay, this is one system. This is another system. Okay, we know that no our rest of the lamps are right here. That means we're going to want repeaters on these sides. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. That's all you'll need. Go boom boom, 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 boom. Okay. Now activate. Place down and get rid of it real fast. Oh, I didn't do that fast enough. Let's try this again. What did I do wrong? Okay, I just don't have enough repeaters. Let's fix this. Sorry, not enough repeaters. Okay, I just needed two more repeaters. Okay, with that going, we can now come down. Let's turn it to night, just so we can see. What did I do wrong? Oh, did that... I... No, they're flashing. Oh, yeah, duh. You can't put repeaters above glowstone or redstone torches and expect them to work. Um, so let's come out one more on both sides. Okay. That ought to do it, right? Okay, now let's activate them. Okay. Did I do something wrong again? Oh, ha ha ha! Repeaters are going the wrong way. Sorry about that, guys. Okay. Okay, that one I did too long an accident. I just didn't do this. Okay. Okay, they're flashing now. Now it's come down. Oh yeah. See that those flashing lights? That's the that, okay. You gotta have those. If you're doing a DJ booth, you gotta have those. Did I just say boof? Like B O O F instead of T H? Hey guys. Let's have a DJ booth! <laughs> so, here's the DJ booth. And you're ready for your dance. Okay, puppies. Dance, dance, dance. And that's how you make the DJ booth. Well, I hope you guys enjoy that, and you're welcome to make it yourself. So, enjoy, and bye.